Hey guys, so today I have a CVS haul and what I went there for was not makeup whatsoever and I was like, I'm going to behave and I'm not going to get anything at all new. But then I walked alongside these Wet n Wild palettes and I went a little bit crazy because these are face palettes in time for Halloween makeup look. So it's not actually like makeup, it's face paint, but it is in the best packaging ever that you can just store this away. I don't know. It's just easy and they had more colors. So I got the Wet n Wild um, Brights palette with more. I had some kind of more um, pastel colors of these, but these are a little bit brighter. So I grabbed that one. This is the Wet n Wild Neutrals palette, which I think is super duper cool. I grabbed all of them. I don't know if I'm going to use all of them for like my makeup looks here, but I'm going to try to use all of them. For you guys but these are so pigmented I really really love them so I grabbed it then they have this smoky palette the red in here stood out to me they have some individual pots too like in black red and white that I saw um, but I like it in this format because I don't use like so much of every color I like having more and then this is the metallics palette so I know I've used like the silver metallic before so I knew I wanted that color again because there's a lot you could do with that but I don't have all of these so these are kind of shimmery and I really like that so I grabbed these and I was super duper excited about that then they had a couple of new eyeshadow palettes um, this one's in in the smoke and it looks like this just like their normal new palettes but these ones were darker and the reds in here looked a little bit different than a lot of drugstore red shades so I'm really excited to try this out. I don't know if I can get it off to like open the package so you can see what I'm talking about. There's some shimmers. So pretty. Okay, so these are what the shades really look like. So there's no glare on it. They're beautiful. I uh, like this one's more of a matte. Then there's the shimmer. This one's another matte. They're fairly close. So I don't know. I'm interested in doing like an eye look and seeing what the real difference. Because maybe they didn't need two of this shade. Um, but you can layer these I feel like over top so maybe they did that on purpose so that you wouldn't run out of that color and it would work with everything else so I'm really excited to try this out I think it's gonna be really really pretty and just fun then I was on the hunt for concealer because I don't know all the concealers that I've bought I haven't loved and I'm just looking for one that I love so I grabbed this covergirl true blend undercover concealer um, this one's in the shade Buff Beige. I don't know. I've seen pretty good reviews on this, so I wanted to try that out. And I had a coupon. CVS always has coupons, so I took advantage of that and got this one. And then there was also, like, a Remmel sale. I think it was buy one, get one 50% off. So I grabbed the Remmel Stay Matte Soft Matte Concealer in the shade... What shade is this? Vanilla. So we'll see. I haven't tried a Remmel... Um, concealer in a long time and I also because it was buy one get one fifty percent grab this Remo London Provocalypse 16 hour kiss proof lip color and it's in the shade Heartbreaker it's in the shade Heartbreaker but it looks like such a pretty fall color this I will swatch yeah that looks really really pretty really really pretty so I'm excited to test this out I know you put one side on I haven't used one of these in forever, but it's basically like a primer and then the color. So I don't know if it's supposed to be matte. I just know it's supposed to be kiss proof and yeah, even if I were to like blend that out, that's still a really pretty color. So I thought it was perfect for fall and since it was buy one get one 50% off, I was like, yes. Um, then last but not least, I grabbed these sheet masks by OK. Um, it's Korean skincare and I grabbed the avocado sheet mask. It says super silky made in Korea and it doesn't say anything else like that. It just has instructions but whatever it was on sale. It's a sheet mask so I was intrigued because I haven't tried this brand and it was on sale. I want to say it was 99 cents on sale usually $1.99. Then I also grabbed their bubble sheet mask, um, exfoliate and cleanse. I just love their packaging. It's, I don't know. It's really cute to me, but what stood out to me most by this brand was the snail sheet mask and it has intense hydration, 
Um, I feel like I watched somebody, maybe it was Tati, when she went to Thailand. Pretty sure that's where she went. And she tried like a snail mask of sorts. So that's what it made me think of. My mom was with me and she was like, why the heck would you want to try that? But I don't know, I'm intrigued by it. So I'll let you guys what, like know what I thought about this brand. I don't know, should I do a video where I would try it on? This one freaks me out a little bit. Um, but they're just regular masks. They don't really say anything else to it. But ingredients is snail secretion filtrate is in here. So that's probably why it's called the snail mask. And I don't know why I'm doing this in the name of beauty. But I'm intrigued. And at the time I felt like I wanted this. So I'm going to stick by it. And I'm still going to try it. Because skincare is skincare. And you know. The packaging is just cute. And on sale might as well try it. So figured I would. So that's everything. I know that was really random. But I really really just got excited about these and I wanted to show it to you guys that they're in stock already before October you really like these you will like them they're really nice so just letting you know but that's everything for this video I will see you guys in the next one love you guys bye